I'm Kohei. I'm 17 years old high school student. It had been a while since I became a high schooler, but I didn't have any friends. I was an introvert. Hey Kohei, can I look at your homework? There. Thanks. Are you a friend of him? No way, I just had to borrow his notebook. I see. Who wants to be a friend with that kind of gloomy guy? Why do they have to say such things? Hmm? The cake shop that I found recently was really good. Sounds nice. We all should go there together. Whoa, I'm looking forward to it. <gasps> Did she smile at me? Maybe my mind was playing tricks on me. Her name is Marina. She was an outgoing gal and everyone in my class liked her. She was the popular one. She lives in a different world to me, I guess. Oh, it's this late already? My parents both worked since I was little. They both had to work until late. They also worked on the weekends too. So they used a housekeeping service for making dinners and cleaning around the house. That lady is late tonight. I'm really hungry. Hello? Ma'am, you're late today. Huh? I came here for the housekeeping service. Nice to meet you. When I opened the door, the classmate was standing there with a puzzled look on her face. I couldn't understand what's going on. Marina-san? Oh, Kohei-kun, is this your house? Where's the usual lady? She strained her back. I'm here to fill her in. Huh? You are? You can call me Marina. I'm really good at chores, so don't worry. <laughs> hey! I couldn't believe her, but apparently she knows that her family uses the housekeeping service. I invited her in and took her to the living room. It's already clean. We always get a help with the cleaning. I see. So I just need to make a dinner and clean around the house? Yeah, yeah. You still can't believe me? I told you, I'm really good at housekeeping chores. I'm good at cooking too. Uh, is that so? Oof. <clears throat> hmm? What's wrong? Ah, uh, no, nothing. I'm just gonna whip something up real quick, so just relax. Oh, that being said, do you have anything you want to eat? No, I'll leave it up to you. Roger that. I sat on the sofa to watch news, but I couldn't process any of it. I kept wondering about what's going on in the kitchen. <laughs> this is really weird. My classmate is cooking at my house. There you go. Whoa, that looks kinda good. It's not kinda, it's really good. Haha. <laughs> I'm gonna clean everything up so you can go on and eat. Huh? You're not eating with me? What? I'm working. I can't eat with you. Oh, true. <laughs> You're weird. Marina went on to clean the house. Apparently, she was telling the truth when she said that she was good at chores. Eventually, she finished all the work. Thank you for coming. You really helped us. You're welcome. Thank you for using our service, too. Oh, that reminds me. Did you forget something? Keep this secret from everyone else at school. Huh? Yeah, sure. <laughs> I'm counting on you. She smiled and went home. The house felt so empty after she left. Since then, she came to her house for the housekeeping service. What else will she do for me as a job? I was tempted to test her. Hey. What is it? Could you give me a massage? Mm hmm Sure thing. Huh? You don't mind? You're asking me to do it as a job, right? Yeah, yeah, as a part of your job. Mmm, so, does it feel good? Yeah, yeah. Your body is really stiff. Her boobs are touching my back. Marina always said yes to my requests, so I was getting carried away. Hey, can you clean my ears for me? Mm hmm sure thing. Can you help me eat the dinner? Mm hmm sure thing. Wait, is she willing to do anything if I ask her? She was here for the housekeeping service, but the way she acted made me feel like I had a girlfriend. While I was starting to be attracted to her, I was starting to worry about something else. Does Marina do anything to anyone if it was part of her job? One day, I couldn't help but to test her again. I made her a new request because it popped into my mind. Hey! What is it? Can you wash my back in the bathroom? She wouldn't say yes to a request like this. Mm-hmm. Sure thing. Huh? Are you serious? Huh? But you want me to wash your back, right? 
It's a joke. Why don't you understand? Hey, wait. What the hell is she thinking? I knew I was being selfish, but I was really angry at her. Hmm? I sensed someone standing outside the bathroom. The door opened. M marina Why? Because it's part of my job. I wanted to. Mm, so, are you okay? I'm okay, but... That's good. Marina, why do you do this for a work? The housekeeping service? Yeah. My mom got divorced and she's a single mother. So I do all the chores around the house and that's why I'm good at them. I see. I want to help my mom out. I thought I could make money if I worked for a housekeeping service. So you don't care about what you do if you could make money? Are you even willing to wash the guy's body? I mean, it's not like that. Get out. I don't need you anymore. But I'm still... Enough! Just go home today. I'm gonna pay you the full amount. Okay. Fuck! The lady came back to work soon after. Marina never came to my house again for the housekeeping service. We weren't close to each other at school anyways. We never spoke at school since then. She lived in a different world from the beginning. I was an introvert and she was popular. But I was attracted to her because she was kind to me. Only because I had an opportunity to talk to her. I hype myself up on my own and I'm depressed like this? I'm such an idiot. Hey, watch out, idiot! Huh? Ooga! Are you okay? Call the teacher. <clears throat> oh, you're awake? Are you okay? Marina? When I woke up, Marina was looking at me. Why is she here? A ball hit you in the PE class. Jeez, I was worried about you. Oh. You should sleep a little more. Don't you have to go to work? Huh? The housekeeping. Oh, I'm not working for that anymore. Huh? Really? Why? I told you, I was just filling in. Nakana-san's back is much better now, too. Oh, I see. I only worked in Kohei-kun's house, okay? I couldn't reply because she grinned to me. Are you still worried about me? I... I mean... She was looking up to me as if she was telling me off. I couldn't make up any excuses. I was sorry about what happened. You must have been really confused. I asked you to do something, and I was angry for that. I sure was a horrible customer. I know. I'm sorry. I was jealous of a customer that didn't exist. I'm an idiot. It was what I did as a job, but I wouldn't do it if someone else asked me to do it. I only did it because it was you, Kohei-kun. Hey, why did you say yes to my request? I'm an introvert and... I hate myself for pleasing other people. I never wanted anyone to make fun of me because I didn't have a dad. So I hid everything and tried to be outgoing. Mm. But you were always alone in the class. You didn't please anyone to be liked. I always admire you. It's not like that. I never liked to be alone, so I was always jealous of you because you had many friends. Really? Really. Oh, so I guess we are really similar in a way. Maybe. She was walking next to me, smiling. I felt like I was obliged to ask her. Hey. What is it? Can I ask you to come to my house again as the housekeeper? Not to fill anyone in, but as the official one. Your house orders the service every day, right? Yeah, that's right. Why? I feel like I'm commuting wife. I'm going to your house to make a dinner every day. Huh? Uh, I mean, I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and... Are you okay with that? Hmm? Sure thing. She said as she looked away. Her cheeks were bright red, but it was probably because of the setting sun. Does she say that? Because she's embarrassed? I thought...